It's locked. <coughs> oh, don't worry. It isn't COVID. I got a strange case of the Nancy Drew flu. It's highly contagious. Are you ready to catch a case? <laughs> Nancy Drew, Travis J. Space. <laughs> Space here on YouTube, and welcome back to another fun, scary, creepy, hard episode of <laughs> Nancy Drew Curse of Blackmore Manor. Not the curse of Blackmore Manor, just Curse of Blackmore Manor. I'm starting to realize looking over these Nancy Drew games that a lot of these Nancy Drew games do not have the in the beginning where you'd want to say the. Um, actually, in one instance, <sighs> sorry, one instance uh, where that's really relevant um, was Nancy Drew, was it the Secret of Shadow? No, that was the Secret of Shadow Ranch. The Treasure in the Royal Tower that one I almost put the in for all of the titles, the branding, the thumbnails, everything. <laughs> I almost made really a really, really, really big mistake. So I'm glad I didn't. And because of not making that mistake, I knew to consciously remember moving forward to really make sure is that Nancy Drew game start with the or is it just what it is? Like Shadow Ranch or sorry, I keep going back to Shadow Ranch. <laughs> like this one, like Curse of Blackmore Manor. It's just Curse of Blackmore Manor. That's it, that's all. All right, folks. Well, I do have a very strong feeling that we are getting to the bottom of these episodes. We're getting to the end here. And I'm very nervous. I'm very scared because uh, I feel like we've been freaked out and scared as much as we possibly can be, I guess. Uh, I don't know if there's any more jump scares or anything crazy like that, but we're just going to have to jump right in and find out now, aren't we? Um, let's get this key done. The key is a must. It's a must. And with this key too, there's a lot of possible options or possible variations to build this key, but there's one variation we need to complete the Penvalin legacy to finally open this lock and use all the penvolin secrets to unlock one giant penvolin secret whoa that's exhilarating <laughs> so on that note um oh my gosh i do this every time do you got your tea yeah good 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 it's tea today oh not wine oh okay Switching it up. All right. Maybe I'll do wine one day. <laughs> and you got your blanket? Oh, jolly good. Jolly good. I got mine here. Nice and warm. And last but not least, you're cozy, right? You're quite comfortable. Yeah? All right. That's all that matters, love. And as long as you're toasty, roasty, cozy, snug, bug in a rug, then we can start. Thank you guys so much for being here to share together our mutual love and admiration for all things Nancy Drew. Let's begin, Clue Crew. I've got my eyes on you. Okay. Timer is on. All right, let's begin. Okay. Oh, look at this. Okay, same old, same old. <laughs> Nothing crazy different here. 1901, which means it's 7 o'clock. On the dot. Ah. Minus one minute. Uh, okay. So, figure out what to do with that box with the prongs on top that I found in the old lab. We I haven't done that yet. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe I'm supposed to take some sort of prongs out. Aha. Uh -huh. So, basically, that's the key task. 
I wasn't sure if that was just figuring out that there is a key task or the actual key task. So, oh. I haven't done that yet. Oh, yes we have. Yes we have. Okay. Whatever. I think I'm kind of over it. I'm over the, the to-do tasks for now. Uh, <laughs> oh, I think I had it all written out here in the last... Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Of course I did. Of course I did. Of course I did. Of course I did. Um, yeah. So. Oh, we, we don't have the, the key mold. Did I leave it in the basement again? Oh, damn it. Oh, great. We got to go all the way back down into the dungeon, into the workshop. There we go. All right, now let's go. Is there anything else that we should see here? All right. Oh, everything seems nice and calm. It doesn't seem like Linda has had much activity lately. Um, especially when we go talk to her. She does have, she doesn't have much to say. So I have a feeling that she's either, her condition is worsening, if she really is a werewolf with like anthropy, or, or um, she's the culprit. <laughs> but I, I don't know who to think, what to think, how to think, you know what I mean? There are so many culprits in this place. Ethel, though, is on the top of mine. I don't know about you guys, but I'm getting a very suspicious feeling about Ethel. And we did discuss that in a previous episode. I did talk about how she's been kind of running things. Or, sorry, she's... Uh, okay. She... To get the heck out of these secret rooms. To get the heck out of these rotating, spinning, mechanical rooms. Ah, it's never fun. It's easy, but it's never fun. <laughs> uh, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, one thing, actually, before we try to figure this key out. Um, Red Wolf. Oh, <laughs> Red Wolf. <laughs> um, yes, Red Wolf told me about. Uh, she said that, which is good. I've been recording a lot of Nancy lately. I usually don't record two at a time, but I've been doing that past week or so. <laughs> so I've been kind of moving fast, you know what I'm saying? Um, but I did catch the comment, a comment from Red Wolf. Um, who mentioned that oh come on i don't want to forget it her tips are the greatest uh, oh yes yes i keep looking at linda's door because i know it's something to do with linda um she said that before the game ends which is good timing because if we get the key right in this level or sorry in this episode chances are this will be the end of the game so good call red wolf good call your instincts are great she told me to go into linda's room and check her nightstand. Apparently there's something new over there. Oh, okay, not yet, not yet. But she did say, and I am remembering something. I don't want to say what, but I know when I was a kid, there was something here and of all things to be sitting there, that's not the thing you want to see sitting there. So I'm going to keep that secret to myself. <laughs> and you'll just have to wait. <laughs> Be in Red Wolf on her head here. Head of the Linda? Game. Okay, I understand. I'll talk to you later. Alright, Linda. This is smart now. I wish I could check out her other bedside. Maybe just open the curtain and say, what the hell? Okay, so... Let's see here. So book, lion, star, snake eating tail. Okay, let's just start from scratch. I know we did so many different variations the last time and I got messed up a lot. And actually I do apologize once again because I did have to leave that day early. So I wasn't able to 
follow through, I guess, uh, with the entirety of the key puzzle. Now, before Jin goes to bed, I want to make sure... Uh, ah. Yes. The Mutivus Liber. Whatever the... I'm not saying it right. <laughs> That's not how you say it. Uh, okay. Yeah, this is the one. Okay, so I just want to make sure all of my things are right here. So bottom right, man, pointing. I'm starting from the bottom right. So I'm starting right here. Sun, got it. Rainbow, got it. Comet, got it. Mouth, got it. Pegasus, got it. T. Water drop. Pergamentum exit. <laughs> we all know that one's Pergamentum. You know what? At this point now, if I ever see a dragon eating its own tail or a snake eating its own tail, Pergamentum exit. <laughs> Actually, I wondered. Hmm. That's more like a dragon eating its own tail. And it's not really eating its own tail either. <laughs> Okay, I may just be getting too specific, but yeah, that's odd. It doesn't seem like that's that's right. Okay, so this is definitely our lion girl, and we have the right thing for that, which is one slit down the middle, gone and gone, so that the metal will... Okay, okay. Arai. So now let's go to the book. You see, mouth, sun, and pergamentum eggs are. <laughs> ah, ah. Snake slash dragon eating its own tail. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. Newman Lumen! <laughs> this one's Phil. So there's no. There's no indication for a key there. Uh, oh, this is interesting. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, never mind. I thought that was a key prompt there. So I was going to say, why is there one on this side, not one on that side? But it's just, it's an eye. Pirididi. Uh, the mouth. Now, this is the only coat of arms. I'm just going to triple check because now I'm not sure. When I say this out loud, I need to make sure that I'm not lying. Okay, yes. <laughs> yes. So this is the only coat of arms with a mouth. So it's safe to say that this one is also correct. There. Move aside. Out of my face. Out of my way! <laughs> I'm always being bombarded by objects. Sun is... Okay, well, you know what? That sun does look a little different. Let's see if there's any more suns... At all. Any big, big suns. No? No? Are we sure? There's a sun on there, but that's a rainbow. That's our rainbow one. No. No. Uh-uh. This one has a, a lion too. And this one's just a straight line. So I'm gonna put lion two. Lion two is just that. Okay. And Pegasus. This also has a Pegasus. So maybe for Pegasus 2, uh, I'll put full, fill. Okay, so we do have a, a few, oh, and there's another, there's a water drop. So we'll assume that that's, that, well, it is written down as fill, so that's probably right, I want to say. We also have a water drop up here, so I think it's probably best that I put water drop two, which is just a line. There we go. Okay, now we're, but this one also has a comet. So I kind of want to put comet two. Maybe we need to think outside the box a little bit here. I don't know. 
Because the other comment I used, I'm almost certain the first time around, was... Oh. This one. Yeah, because it's on its own, right? Wow. Okay. Book. Now this is dealing with a book, apparently. But see, now I want to double check because... No? No books? No books? No books? Books? Anyone got a book for me to read? <laughs> no. And that's the only one with the pointing guys. So we know that one's right. The man pointing, that's that's correct. We don't have to change that again. This has a star two. Five pointed star. So it's either plus, which I don't understand where I got uh, over here. So it's either the plus or it's, I'll put star two, which is fill. Okay, oh, okay. So the snake eating its own tail, Pergamentum exit. <laughs> that one's, <laughs> see, it's not really eating its own tail. There's the tail. It's just biting itself. That's not very interesting. Okay, Pergamentum exit, that one is right. So we can confirm, folks, we can confirm that these last three are in the right position. These are the correct positions. And Lion is in the right... Okay, let's start with this row first. Let's not jump ahead of ourselves. For this one, we got two different variations for Star and Pegasus. Sun, we've only got, we've only got one, right? It's only Newman Lumen. Yeah, so, right? There's no other suns. I'm not gonna count this one, sun and moon, because I just feel like that one's, that one's specifically rainbow, just because there's only one rainbow on the Code of Arms. So yes, I see here that sun is also confirmed to be a fill. Perfect. Now we can jump on the last row. Lion is correct. T. Is there any T's on any of the other plaques? Now we know this plaque has it. So another T. T. I feel like I've done this one before too, but we need to be extra certain here, folks. Oh, star. Did I get to... S oh, okay, we did deal with that. All right, we just dealt with that. Just like just. Where's Alan's coat of arms? I really want to see Alan's coat of arms. Or sorry, Hugh. Yeah, <laughs> Alan's his grandfather. Okay, so the T is confirmed. So let's take a look. Sorry guys, if you've been wondering how a few episodes why I'm always itching my nose, it looks like I'm probably picking at it. I'm starting to wear makeup again. So <laughs> getting used to this on my face is a little difficult <laughs> it's a little difficult I'm trying to bear with it here a very good friend of mine gave me a bunch of new makeup new to me makeup and I'm very happy about it oh yeah I've been experimenting and I'm kind of liking it I'm digging it it gets me more into the mode and gets me a little more excited I feel more ready you know if that makes sense uh, at first it's just eyeliner. I like to put on eyeliner and that's it. You know, no foundation or nothing, but with all these lights and the HD and the backdrop and it, I just thought I'd perk myself up a little bit. Actually, my friend thought that'd be a great idea and I love her and I said thank you and I took her advice. So here I am. So if you see me itching my nose, it ain't, I ain't picking nothing. Or maybe I am. <laughs> Sometimes I might be, but rest assured it's just this makeup around my nose. Itchy. Okay, so Lion and T have been confirmed. Let's uh, make sure those are correct. Lion, T. Now Rainbow. See, this has four different colors, so you could almost consider this one to be Rainbow too, right? But we're looking, we're looking specifically for a symbol here. So that is now confirmed. Rainbow. Uh, let's see if it's set up properly. It is. It is. Okay. Last set. So book. Was there any other, other than this one, 
I need books. 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 No. No books. No. And you know what? I think we can safely can safely confirm there's no books over here either. There's no. I was gonna say there's no coat of arms in the library, is there? <gasps> you know what I just realized? These Okay, first of all, these lighting fixtures are ginormous. <laughs> if you really think about it, like, say, just kind of comparing it to this doorknob and the door over here. I mean, Nancy probably stands to about here. I probably stand to about here because I'm, like, six foot tall. <laughs> so, <laughs> depending on how tall that doorway is, I'm assuming it's about six foot. But, yeah, if that's correct, if my perception's correct here, can I look at it more closely? That's a pretty massive scone, uh, you know, candle holder going on there. But anyways, uh, that was my second observation. The first observation that caught me off guard, do you guys notice how the main mantelpiece is a dragon? With its wings, or a big bird of some sort. I can't see the head, but oh no no, I don't want to go in there. That place freaks me out. See, oh whoops, see right from this angle you can see the head better. Cool, eh? Oh, and there's the legs, or the legs are part of oh that's cool sorry sidetracked of course somebody just yell squirrel <laughs> okay so the book i want to say is correct as well because there's no other books and whatever so for f oh there is a lion too oh there is a lion too Shoot, I didn't see that, guys. So this might actually be just straight. I'm going to make sure to circle all of this. Any ones that have two, I am circling them so that they're not confusing. Yeah. All right, see? See, folks? Keep it still! <laughs> Keep it steady now! Uh, oh, a little mark there. But yeah, I have I have written it all out here in the same order as you're seeing here in front of you. Uh, it may be flipped, I don't know. Um, but I have multiple variations here. So, let's make sure the ones that are confirmed are in the right spot. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Right? Yeah. Okay, so now the ones that are not confirmed, let's try... Let's try something different. I'm gonna try... Uh, the second option for each. So Lion is also this. T is correct, Rainbow is correct. Uh, this far end. Book. Water Drop 2 is just that. And Comet 2 is just this. Huh. Okay, this looks a little more like a key, you guys. Yeah, take a look at that. I'm kind of squinting. I'm trying to see, you know, like if it were to smelt together. Yeah, this looks like a key, you guys. I'm really nervous because if this is a key, I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me, pig. <laughs> uh, huh, excuse me again. <gasps> Burps, hiccups, and name it. We got it all here. Try to chase I'm really nervous now, though. Because if we get the key, right, we get it, and it's correct, and everything else. Let's go talk to some people. Oh! <sighs> 8 o'clock. I don't like that. Shh! Thank you. <laughs> Ugh! Thing creeps me out. That grandfather clock. Most grandfather clocks are cute and kind of like fun and quaint, you know? That one's just scary. <laughs> There she is! Yes. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. Run along! Run along! Run along! <laughs> oh, let's 
visit the fountain. Oh. Mm. <sighs> I haven't really taken a moment, you know, taken a moment just to to take in the surroundings, the ambiance. You know, we did it a lot in White Wolf High School Creek. And especially Ghost Dogs of Moon Lake when we were in the forest and the birds and taking the music and the sights and the smells we think we can smell. <laughs> we can imagine what we're smelling. This is one of those moments, I think. And we haven't done it yet. This is what, episode 10? We haven't even... So yes, let's all just take a minute. <sighs> the water rippling. You can probably smell all kinds of plants in this big conservatory. Ah, and you're staring at that little water hose, tempted to start squirting things. Perhaps Mrs. Drake from over the planet. <laughs> oh, what is that spittle spattle going on? <laughs> run! Run! <laughs> She's coming! <laughs> Alright, that was great. And we need to do that more often, don't we, guys? Clue crew, we need to take a moment to sit and appreciate what her interactive has created for us. These immersive environments, like, there's so much more than just mysteries to me. And, uh, you know, and what the game is supposed to be for. For me, it's also an ambiance thing, too. Like, playing the game is, is being there. It creates a feeling and just a sense of you can really imagine yourself in this situation, in this place, in this environment. And the music that's playing is likely what you'd want to hear if you were exploring so it all just adds up really well and every now and then you gotta take that moment you know so there's nothing else here either hmm. nothing in his notes oh and red wolf was telling me that this background because i asked about it in the uh, previous episode Thank you, Red Wolf. Red Wolf said that this background is actually, um... Yeah, Wickford Castle. <laughs> For treasure in, a royal, in the Royal Tower. Yeah, so I guess Nigel's been getting around. He's been to Wisconsin, he's at Wickford. Now, see, it didn't look like Wickford to me at all because of how dark it is, but um, Red Wolf had mentioned that as well, that it darkened it, and now look at it. However, though, too, as well, I didn't mention this to Red Wolf, but Red Wolf doesn't... Don't you guys think this hallway looks a little too long to be at Wickford? I mean, granted, they easily could have edited it or changed the proportion, I don't know, some perception, but... Oh, it could be also because Treasure in a Royal Tower was the original, like, small, boxy, uh, I want to say overlay, that's not it, interface. Yeah. So now that it's rectangular, maybe stretched out, this is what, uh, Treasure in the Royal, oh, <gasps> ooh, potential, like, imaginatory thought implementing to you right now. This could very well give you a quick little sneak peek into what, uh, Charge of the Royal Tower Remastered might look like when they extend the screen to the widescreen. Ooh, okay, that was cool. That was cool. We spawned a whole train of thought there. Um, speaking of remastered, you guys have seen, I don't know if you guys have seen, but they did do a remaster for Charge of the Royal Tower. Not officially her interactive, because I'd be mad if they did, because <laughs> they need to do Stay Tuned for Danger first, which is like seeing all kinds of problems for a few years now. They just need to remaster it like they did Secrets Can Kill. Actually, I would like them to just, it would be great if they just remastered the first five classics, you know, and gave them a full interactive 3D environment with Unreal Engine and, um, and the characters and everything else. And I think that'd be really cool. I might be a bit too much. Like I know, Midnight in Salem, you know, no one likes to talk about it, it's like the elephant in the room, but with Midnight in Salem, it was the first time they used Unity Engine and all this other stuff, and which is similar to Unreal Engine, but it just didn't give the full effect, you know, it kind of, it cast it away from the essence, the ambiance, the feelings, that is just explaining in the conservatory, all of that was stripped, I felt, anyways, for me, with Midnight in Salem, it felt like that that uh, area of opportunity I could connect and immerse myself in the game, feel like I'm there with the music and the, you know, and getting a feeling overcome, overwhelm me 
that just doesn't happen with the new way they're making the NES2 games. So I think if they took the Unreal Engine approach and uh, started by remastering the first five series, see how we all like the engine, carry on the series NES2 34 with Unreal Engine, then maybe people would be drawn back in, the original players anyways would be drawn back in to the series, I hope. Maybe that gives Nancy Drew Games some uh, insight. Her interactive? You listening? You taking notes? <laughs> Cause, uh, sorry, I keep going back and forth because look it, there's another little symbol in the door frame. Oh my goodness, no put arms though. What was I doing? Oh, we were doing a last check of all People, places, and things. So let's talk to Lulu too, because <laughs> people, places, Hello. and birds. How about a hint? Talk to me. Bye, bird. Okay. Bye, bird. So we got no more hints from uh, Lulu. That's good. Mrs. Drake, clear. Linda, clear. Uh, we'll do some phone calls in a second. Arr. I want to make sure we have nothing else to we have to say to Jean, other than playing a game. Hi. Oh. Hi. I should get going. Bye. Okay, it's a little too early for you to be going through your teenage hormone phase, girl. Right? Well, she seems a little young, doesn't she? To be getting moody with me? <laughs> Unless I'm bothering her, but I don't think there's anything to... Okay, alright, sorry, I'm progressing. That was just odd. Jane's always so... Da -de -de -de. Seems so out of it now. Maybe it's because we were accusing her of that whole ritual thing. I don't know. But you know what? We need to call everyone right now. This way we know for certain we've done everything we can. You have reached me. Petros. No one can come to the phone right now. Feel and I also want to wanna do all this because I'd like you. to trigger that. Still at her um, nieces. I'd like to trigger that event Red Wolf was speaking of. Because I am remembering and it's coming to me now. So me and Red Wolf are kind of on the same page right now but I don't want to fit because I my biggest fear right now is that if I go to the basement and get the right key I could trigger the end of the game hello hi Ned hey what's the latest I'll what's talk to you soon I'll be waiting um, I could trigger the end of the game and if I trigger the end of the game without seeing that last little thing I'll just no I just no <laughs> and plus you know it's just I don't know I mean, me and Red Wolf, we've, we've seen these games, all these games, multiple times in our childhood, growing up. But I'm if you're a watcher that's the Transylvanian Symposium on still there, phenomena. Um, we'll be back on the but dance. if you're someone that's Only never then. played Nantuja or seen Nantuja games before, then, you know, you don't know what to expect, you don't know what to see, what to hear, etc., etc. So I like to kind of cover all bases, you know? I, I like to also play a little dumb. Like, I usually don't remember anything when I play could be two three months from now and I go to play this game again I'd still would be like all oh, right all oh, right all oh, right but I want to create an experience with you guys that um, where we question things and we you know go through it because I know some other Nancy Let's players um, they make they make no mistake <laughs> of making it known how much they know about the games and and this and that they know it like the back of their hand and I just don't want to ruin the mystery and I want to ruin the fun for the newcomers out there uh, but me and Red Wolf, we, we know, see, this is something we consciously know right now, just because we know, let's get into the nitty gritty here, that there's one more thing to see, and I almost, if Red Wolf wouldn't have said anything, I would have just jumped over right to the end of the game. Anyway. Felicity! The door! The door! You're gonna need a bigger boat. Boy. Well then, it, okay, the last thing I could think of to trigger some changes would be oh wait a minute we haven't called Hugh in a long time boom I bet you he's got some things to say that may trick Hugh Penvalin hello Mr. Penvalin it's Nancy Drew again yes good to hear from you I am a bit pressed for time however did you know that Jane's mother is in Rome Renee is in Rome too I knew she was traveling but she neglected to tell me her itinerary fortunately it's a big city but thank you for the warning Anything else? Okay, so earlier I thought there was some scandal going down, but those two are not seeing eye to eye, it sounds like. Okay, good. It was nice talking to you. Do keep me posted. I say, you break Linda's heart, I'm gonna break your neck. <laughs> Alright, uh, the one thing I did want to do was 
bed a whole night. Maybe maybe we have to keep woken up one more time. I don't know. If not, we might just have to go ahead and Oops. I'm hitting things. I've got long arms. I can hit things <laughs> really easily, real quickly. And with in a space where everything is right in my face. These arms feel like they're in lockdown. Cords. I'm gonna break something. I better not get scared again. Did we order all the food we could? I really just don't want this game to end. <laughs> Bull's head pop, this is Oi! Get him out of here before he Wallace is up the whole rabbit dog! <laughs> hey, this is Nancy Drew. I'd like to order some food. Oh, sure, we've got some loop de loop bangers and mash, pinky and perky in a dog's eye, and they're all Robin Hood. Turkey. Chicken pie, soup. I don't think we've done bangers and mash yet. Bangers and mash. Rogio, Uncle Fred and Johnny Rudder. Uh, okay. All right then. We'll come round and leave it at your Rory. I love how Nancy. Bike potato. Bike potato. I love how Nancy acts like. I mean, now she knows what Cockney is, but she's still okay. <laughs> oh, that message. Oh, I can't even do anything with it. Wait, what if I give it to Linda? Can I give it to Linda? And say, here, I got a letter too. No. What about. Linda? Linda? I'll be going now. <sighs> Poor Nancy. She's trying everything she can to get through to this woman. Well, alright, folks. I'm, I'm a little sad to say that we're just gonna have to jump through this. Go through it. Maybe it doesn't end there. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe. Who knows what? And if it doesn't happen, then I'll, I'll, uh, I'll tell y'all. Oh, shoot. No, I don't want to be there. Wait, can I still operate this thing? Mercury's all covered up. <laughs> Mercury's all covered up. <laughs> uh, so all of these bells that we're hearing are going through the house. Ah, everyone's put losing their mind. <laughs> what are all those noises? <laughs> okay. Alright. Alrighty. Oh, drip drop, drip drip drop. Drip drop, drip 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 drop, drip drop, a drip 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 drop, drip drop, a drip 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 drop, drip drop. Drip, drop. Drip, drop. Drip, drop. A drip, 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 drop. Yay, we're gonna try some variations. I really hope. I really hope. Oh, it's so loud here, I forgot. Okay. <laughs> I could turn my headphones down, but I've got a really great audio mix here. Okay. So. Oh no, we did already set up a variation, right? Yes, we did. No! I don't want to be in here. Open up. Let me out. Let me out. Here we go. Oh, the noise is in the See, this looks like a, a key. What key? There's no key. <laughs> Uh, made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Try, try again. Like episode eight or seven. Alright, come with me. Outside of the room. <laughs> okay. Alright, so. I feel like we should 
try water drop two, which is just this. I mean, this way they're all connecting, right? Oh! Oh, book is supposed to be like this. Travi J. And the water drop one is like that. Or filled, but I, I feel like they need to be connected. And Comet 2 is just that. So let's leave that. Lion. Lion 2 is like that. T is like that, and that's confirmed, and that's like that, and that's confirmed. Uh, five pointed star. You know what? I have a feeling this is open too. Because then these three connect. That kind of connects. The third round here. Wide open by the looks of it. Maybe we can try that. One like this, and then this is filled in. Sun, that's just confirmed. And all of these are confirmed. Okay, let's give that a go. Looks like a key. Sometimes I wonder if I'm like. It doesn't work. Ah! Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I need a special key. The bottom two over here can change. So maybe, what if we fill this? Try filling that. Leave that open, leave that open. Lion is not confirmed. These two are confirmed. But it makes me wonder, maybe it's just that. Let's try that. Five-pointed star is either fill or wide open. Well, you know what? The bottom one's filled, and that's confirmed, so let's try that. Okay, let's give that a go. And then maybe what I can do is just try filling one at a time, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay, that looks like it could be a key. Uh, yeah. I mean, all of them seem like they could be. It doesn't work. I ah! made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Like we have a choice, Mr. Drew. <laughs> like we have a choice. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Drew. Miss Nancy. Okay, back to the drawing board here. Let's try, let's try just changing one thing at a time. Book and Comet are confirmed, or Book is confirmed. Comet is not confirmed. Let's try this variation. And Water Drop, let's try, yeah, let's try that. I'm gonna try like that, the lion one. I feel like I was really certain about that lion. The first go around. Uh, five pointed star, that is. Oh, it's either open or filled. So I'm gonna say, let's try, let's try open this time. Pegasus will leave that open. And the snake eating tail, yeah, 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 mouth. Oh yeah, that never changes. Okay. Try, try again. <laughs> oh, that looked like a key. Sorry, I <laughs> clicked that way too fast. Come on. 
Just show me the money. I'm gonna try doing this. I'm gonna try water drop one, the first water drop we had. And then for comet one, I'm gonna try the first comet we had. For lion, I'll keep it the same for now. Oh, actually, this does look a little more realistic, guys. Look at this. So, open, open, right? Filled. And then open 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 that's kind of an odd pattern too right you're following and then this third line i think is our problem now what if we do fill and then leave that like that or fill it okay let's try both variations i think these two we know we know the last row is correct i wonder if these two rows are now correct because they look very correct the third row is what we'll screw around with now Experiment. Ugh. Let's build her up. We'll likely have to go in. Yeah, the see? That looks like a key! That looks like a key. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling. It doesn't oh. work. You must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's my favorite. Oh, God. We have got to open this high water. Okay, so this third row. The only thing we can change is these two. So we can either do this. Oh, and that. Or open this one and leave this open. Let's try that. Open that one, leave that open, and then we'll try fill and fill. And then I'll try fill. I don't know. It's kind of confusing. <laughs> okay. That looks like a key. Oh. Work. You must have made it wrong. <laughs> well, yeah. might as well melt the old key down and try again. Sorry. Oh, might as well melt it down. <laughs> Alright, so let's take this then and uh again. Um so what was the other variation? We just fill them all in. Let's try that. If this isn't right, then I feel like I might have to revisit the first row. I think the first row, that slit should be open. The middle one. Yeah, see right here, I think they should be connecting here. I think we're getting closer. Much closer. It doesn't work. Ah! Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Ah! Sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Well. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> Mamma mia. Here we go again. Alright, so this time I'm just gonna open this one. So this looks right, this looks this is definitely right, and this now looks right. That just looks like nothing, and maybe that's just the way it is. <sighs> gonna see. I still think it's probably wrong. Oh, that looks right! That looks like three different keys. I'm, I'm just gonna say it right now. 
I wish I could back out before she finishes this. I need a special key. Yeah, I know you do. I know you do. I know you do. Take that. And we're gonna go here. And we're gonna do this. And we're gonna do this. All right. So I think these three are right. I think it's this one that needs to change. Let's try that. I certainly hope that's it. This... Ooh, that just seems accurate, doesn't it? I mean, I've said that about the past two before, but... Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. We don't have a choice. Alright. You know what I'm gonna do? Yeah. We are gonna get this straight, and I mean straight from the horse's mouth. Reversed. It could be reversed, don't you think? I could be losing it, and I feel like that might just cause so much more controversy. Like, oh, did I forget the. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> That's alright, we don't need it this time. Uh. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna triple check, confirm, double check, triple check, whatever the heck. Hmm. Five-pointed star. I don't think that's the five-pointed star. I think this is the five-pointed, because there's three of them. So let me, I'm going to rewrite this out again. I'm going to rewrite this out. Star. Fill. All right. And man pointing. Now is the symbol for that one different? Polly is a stupid bird. Polly is a stupid bird. <gasps> Felicity, the door, the door. The uh, time has come. Shh. For closing book. Holy what a sh <laughs> Okay, so so that's the man pointing. Pointing equals this. So I will try reverse way as well, where I treat this that looks like an opening, right? It could be to fill in. I think we've did that in the last episode. Could be wrong, but we will see. So mouth. Mouth. Is like absolutely certainly this. And then the one above, I think is sun. No, sun is over here. Sun. Or reverse don't fill so I'll put fill but maybe it's reverse don't fill it at all <gasps> pregmentum exit that one is snake uh, that one is let's see all right star Sun what's in the middle there Pegasus Pegasus now, there was two Pegasus, wasn't there? There's this one. That's a unicorn, I'd say. That's a Pegasus. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's there's no more. It definitely had wings. 
so this way. Which is just a straight line. Pegasus. Straight line. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. It's just me a chill as it's going. It doesn't go away. Lion. See, that one has a lion too. But this is a lion on its own. So it, it just has to be that one, no? Okay. Lion. What's next? T. The letter T, which is over here. Letter T is this and that. Okay. Fabulous rainbow is is this and that. Okay. So far so good, but it just kind of feels like exactly the same as we had it. I could be wrong. There were some differences here. Book is plus. See, does that mean filled or does that mean wide open? We're gonna find out pretty soon. Water. Water drop. Well, it's just a water drop. This one might be this. Because if the comet is that. Yeah, if the comment is a, f a, a plus, or everything filled slash not filled, maybe the drop is just a straight line. Where was the other water drop? Over here. And that's filled. I think it's safe we go with the comment one. Let's just try that. Okay. Okay, I think I got an idea. I'm gonna try the reverse. Let's head on down to the forge. See, this is a lot more neater. Okay, so I have like my experimenting up here, all the rows for the keys, second options, blah, blah, blah. Anything that has a second option is circled. So then down here, I've made a more finalized, cleaner version. Hopefully, that is the version that will get us where we need to be. So let us make our way. We've looked at it all. Oh, I hate when that happens. Oh, I did it wrong. Oopsie. One, two, two, one, one. No, I did screw up. Ha 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 ha. One, two, one, 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 two, one. Yeah. Okay! Can I actually get it here? Two to third second I love two to third second. Oh! I don't know how to do it, but definitely keeps me nice and calm. And uh, yeah, therapy. Two good throat singing is therapy. The meditation like that. All right, all right, all right. So we're gonna flip it around. We're gonna fill this in. We're gonna fill that in. I think we've done this before. We're gonna fill this in. We're gonna fill that in. I'm gonna fill this in. Yeah, I don't. This might not be it. I 
fill. So what if we do the opposite? <laughs> I keep it open. Like so. And like so. And like so. And like so. Right, let's give that a go. I. The way it's laid out is just giving me a... Uh, but we have to be certain with all... Looks like a key. Oops! <laughs> I had my head turned too long. It doesn't work. Ah! I must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. So it isn't a reverse thing. Alright. No one's loud in here, but let's try to start here and go reverse again. Something I'm missing. I'm missing something. I'm missing something, and there's no doubt about that. I'm not sure what the heck it is. Like, it might even just be something in the game that I haven't, uh, you know, come across yet, or something. Uh, itchy. Ooh, real itchy right there. Oh. I can't touch my face. Can I scratch it with a pen? No, that's just... I'm gonna create... I'm gonna put pen on my face. Is there something, like, itchy? Uh, yeah, that's nice. That's better. Huh. Alright. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Lion. Letter T. Star. Which way is the handle on this thing? Oh, okay, okay. That is confirmed. I have that written down accurately. Now, let's try an alternative version. And I might have to rewrite it right out. The same way? Okay, let's just do that. Book equals water equals comet lion Ring 
bow, star, pegasus. If there's, if it is reversed, I don't think it's reversed anymore. Because if it was, that would create a lot of variations, right? Every variation you have, you'd have to flip it and try another way. Or try the opposite way. And if there's multiple symbols and multiple alternatives and flipping back, that's just way too much. You know? Doesn't seem right to me. And there's no other... Uh, pardon me. There's no... Uh, Oh, pointing, not painting, pointing. There's no like hidden, uh, what do you call it? Hidden symbols anywhere either. Pergmentum exit. Now this one is just confirmed at this point. Like just confirmed, so we can check that off. And so is mouth, because there's no mouth on anything else. Yeah, there's two mouths technically on this one. So mouth is confirmed. Pointing, the pointing portrait, that is also confirmed. So the last row is right. At least we know that. The last row is without a doubt. In both alternative options is correct. So we'll make sure that's correct. Perfect. Now the alternative for the star would be the plus. Okay. Sorry, I'm thinking very hard. Something tells me. Something tells me if there's nothing, uh, I guess that would mean it's filled. Pegasus. Where's the second Pegasus? That's the only Pegasus. Like, that's a unicorn. That's different. So, really, I think we can confirm that Pegasus is also, also correct. Uh, same with the sun. Like, there's no other... There's no other sun. There's this sun, but... It just doesn't make sense and that's rainbow anyways I don't think they would I don't think they would double up and use the symbols for more things you know what I'm saying so I'm gonna put a check mark next to rainbow and the letter T I mean again there's only one so we know that that's correct uh, lion now lion I usually go with that one. Is there another lion? There's a lion here. <gasps> oh! No! No, we're out of time. That's alright. We'll carry on here. Okay, so the other only alternative would be this one. For lion. And I cannot confirm nor deny <laughs> that that is... Uh, oh, and there's only one sun, too. Okay. Book. I think there's only one book, so I think that could be confirmed as well. Yeah. Yeah. Book. So in both variations so far, book is the one. Water. I was using this one. However, I think one of these has a water drop in it. Yeah, this one, which is just fill. And comet. That's one or the other, but for this one, we will try the downward. So it's really only water, comet, it's only these two, these two, 
and this one that is buggered up or may have an alternative option. Now before we begin though I want to start the first variation over but I want to try it differently so instead of fill how about this? Worth a shot I guess and then uh and we'll keep all that the same because that's pretty much what's going on. Just to see. And then we'll try the alternative uh, version. I don't like that. One, two, one, 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 two, one. <laughs> Let us out! <laughs> Let us in! All the way back, all the way down. It seems so far away once you uh, do it so many times. <laughs> okay. Here I am. I might be wrong. Okay! That does look like a key. It looks a lot more like a key. Let's see. It doesn't work. Ah! You must have made it wrong. Well, okay. might as well melt the old key down and try again. Yeah, that's what we were going to do. Come with me. Alright, oh. Alright, let's see here. Alternative. This should just work, you know what I mean? Okay, book is confirmed. Fill. I'll try this for comment. This is the alternative version now. Confirm, confirmed. Fill. And then all that is confirmed. Okay. <gasps> no! Oh. I just sent myself down a spiraling, downward spiral into nothing, into being lost in those rooms. Alright. Okay! Don't really look like a key to me. It doesn't no. work. You must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, this is, uh... Quite certainly the, a really annoying puzzle. <sighs> okay, we're gonna go back to the original here. Lion. Okay. This is the way I had it before. Or, yeah before originally the first variation uh part of me wants to flip it around just with oh, i say just with these guys let's try let's just try here if the plus means to fill and then the fill means to empty Ah, like this? Maybe, let's see. Ah! Oh, scared me. Okay, that's different. 
that's different and it looks like a key. Uh, uh, must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. How about we just make it look like a key? So... How does this go again? Connects with that. I don't know. I feel like that needs to be open. But I have it written down as fill. So. This should be the combination, right here. No difference, oh, wait a minute. Okay, hold on, this is the original version, right? Isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so what if we start changing just one at a time? So, what are we? Fill it up. Okay, let's try that. Water would fill it up. It doesn't work. You must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key right. down and try again. So now. Try. I'm going through each variation, y'all. One little step at a time. Okay, so if water is not it, let's put it back. And let's put, let's fix Comet. Because it seems that there's different variations. I need a special key. Uh, of course you do. It doesn't work. Uh. I must have made it wrong. Well, might as well melt the old key down and try again. Well over the end of the episode, so I will have to <sighs> bury the hatchet for right now. I still don't understand. It's so sad. Well, folks, Ooh, I don't like those sounds. It looks like we're gonna have to uh, leave her be for now. We are at a tan, so that's, that's one thing. That must be the oh. food I ordered. Oh, right! Oh, bangers and Tommy's mash. cooking is beginning to grow on me. Oh, we've already had that, I guess. Mashed potatoes. Mm. With peas and sausage. I'm butter. stuffed. I want that whole meal right now. Mm. All right. Well, folks, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. All I know is that going into the next episode now, we do have a lot of uh, a lot of write-outs. We've got a first variation, second variation. This is just a bit of a mess. Chicken scratching. Um, but we do have an idea now 
of the options available to us that would work. Um, that first one seemed like it would work right away because it's straightforward. Each symbol from the coat of arms, I may need to go online and see if I'm in the right direction. I just want to know if I'm doing the right thing with my information. I don't want the answer. I just want to know if the way I'm looking at this is the right perception. Like we can flip it, you know, we could flip all of them. We could flip only some of them, but that's so many variations. And I was about to get into it down there when we switched the water and comet symbols, but then it kind of hit me just how many variations we'd have to go over. So yeah, not happening. I'll have to do some research online and uh, I'll let you guys know. All right. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I love you guys very much. And thank you for hanging with me and hanging in there because we are getting close to you and the anticipation is just rising here. So, uh, but I do need your help. I need your guys' help for this one. This is a big, big, difficult, hard one. It's a very big puzzle. It definitely is like the culmination of all these other smaller puzzles and all the history of the game and the people coming into one big final hoorah. <laughs> so I need your help with the hoorah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, what do you guys think? What am I doing wrong here? Maybe you guys are seeing it. You know, that's why I like to work with you guys because you guys be on the other end watch and go, no, 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 you had it right. Oh, you know. So uh, open up. Let me know how what you're thinking, what you're seeing, and what you would do if you were me. And we will try to work through this. And get to the bottom of it because I do have a very strong feeling once we get this key that it'll just open Pandora's box on this entire investigation it might just end it so on that note toodles for now ta-ta <sighs> ciao till next time howdy folks did you like that video well then why don't you go ahead and give that thumbs up a smackaroo don't want to miss out on the next episode? Give the subscribe button some love and make sure to turn your notifications on. That way I can give you a bell a ring, let you know when it is served. Still need more to chew on? Take a bite of my new YouTube Instagram account at Travi J Space to keep up to date with the channel's inner workings and news of upcoming projects and episodes. Thanks for watching. See you next time.